Rick Morris going for the triple. Does he have enough time? Oh! oh! I cannot believe my eye. Backside triple court, 1440. Four can... full rotations. The first ever true triple cork in a contest. What a night for snowboarding. First ever triple cork. And it didn't. Will we see something that's never ever been landed on dirt before? Let's listen to the crowd and watch as Chuck goes for history. Chuck Carruthers dreamed of being the first person to land a body vario on a motorcycle. Chuck, Chuck Carruthers. In 2004, he did just that, sticking the trick on his first attempt and clinching a spot in action sports history. Off that 45 foot ramp, fully around, he finds the grab holds. Here we go. One, two, oh! oh! If that is what it's about, Elena Height with the double alley of rodeo. Never been done, female or male, half pipe riding. A hey, history being made. A perfect 100 in ski or snowboard superpipe or slope style. It had never been done until Sean White in 2012. Starts off massive. Combinations, amplitude, and of course, doing tricks that no one else on earth can do. Wow. That is why this dude is Sean White. A trick that only two people on earth can do into a trick. Front side double court 1260 that no one on earth can do. That's never happened before. It's unreal. I've been wanting that 100 forever. At Barcelona in 2013, 16-year-old Mitchie Brusco attempted to land the first 1080 on a skateboard in X Games competition. And here goes Mitchie. Another 1080 attempt. Oh! Mitchie Brusco! Mitchie Brusco with his first 1080 ever made. Mitchie just loving it. He's the third person ever to do a 1080. First one that we've ever seen at X Games. In 2011 at the Winter X Games in Aspen, Kelly Clark had a lot more on her mind than just winning gold. She was looking to make history. All right, now the big question. Look, Kelly Clark is going to win the gold medal. It's not about that. It's about the first ever ladies 1080 in the superpipe. Progression of women snowboarding. It's in full effect, and here she comes. Let's hear it for Kelly Clark. History being made. Heck yeah. That was awesome, Brad. Kelly Clark already had the gold, but she uh, chose to take a victory lap that will be written into the history books forever. During the 2013 X Games in Barcelona, Zach Warden redefined what it meant to go big in BMX Big Air. Zach Warden back in the mix. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. There's so There's much going on in this so trick. So much going on. You're doing a backflip while you do a bike flip, and then throwing a late tail whip. Look how clean he landed that feet right on the pedals. Unreal, and then you still got to pull the triple whip if you want it to be your yeah. dream ride. Let's not downplay this right here. This is a triple tail whip on a 27-foot-tall quarter pipe. Wow, what an epic run that was right there. Every rider in the house is watching. The world is watching as Travis Pastrana, everybody in this house, wow. is now standing up and cheering on the 199. Go, Travis! Oh! Oh, my word! A double back flip from Travis Pastrana! Are you kidding me? How many times can you find the Holy Grail in one bit? There is Sean White, the man, the myth, the legend, trying to make history with the three-peat. 
and trying to bring us new tricks we've never seen before here at X Games. Well, out of the gate, probably one of the nice methods I've ever seen. Look at how huge he's going. That first backside air was bigger than anything he did last night, and there's his double cork 1080. There it is! And the double McTwist 12-6-X, pretty much spinning every direction you could ask for, flipping every direction you could ask for. That's, that's not, that's not, no, you can't do that. It's madness for the brain. Sean White has the most medals at Winter X Games. The Moody Bob going, get him going, pushing it up. Everybody picture it, here we go. Feel it. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Yeah, look at this. Tony Hawk, everybody.